What is going on y'all welcome back i know y'all wondering like hey why is he doing a video in the grocery aisle okay the reason why i'm doing this video in the grocery aisle because we're going to be talking about arrival today and we're going to be talking about how it is crashing and i'm telling you you're going to need a drink for this one even though i don't drink stay tuned for this i'm not a financial advisor let's go ahead and jump straight into arrival let's go Welcome back. I am New Techno God. Tonight, we're going to be talking about some arrival. Yes, I'm talking about arrival. Now, here's my thing about arrival. We are looking into the future. Arrival has dropped so much, 0.86 cents. But here's my thing. The absolute growth is going to be inevitable. Multiple partnerships. I've seen Arrival drop and I'm like, hey, this is the chance I'm going to take and I am going to buy. I'm taking a risk and I believe I'm taking a good one. I feel so good about the future that I am going to continue to buy in. Okay. Now, don't take my word for it. You can do your own investing. I'm not a financial advisor. Everything that you invest is on you but hey let's get straight into it now the reason why i am so excited about this right now we've seen what happened to the stock market we've seen what happened with most of the stocks but my biggest concern is that arrival is future to technology and i believe they are here to stay whether or not that's going down the numbers we see things happening Arrival unveils its roomy ride share car prototype designed with Uber ahead of testing next year. Testing in 2022. Don't you, don't you think that right now they are preparing? It's called Arrival for a reason. Okay? A lot of people are going to miss out on this. EV technology, particularly vans and buses and batteries in multiple markets, is a contester, a competitor in this crypto market. If you think for one second that this that this stock is not going to bounce back, I believe that people are wrong or call me crazy if you want to. But in my personal opinion, let's see what else is going to happen. Check this out. The world economy could be more than double size of 2050. Check this out. Let's skip a little bit further. Emerging markets E7 could grow around twice as fast as advanced economies on average. Okay. Cities, everything is going to be advancing. By 2050, about 75% of the world population will be living in cities. Then there will be building touching the sky and cities will be settled from the ground up. Roads will be built up several floors and to move around the building will be connected to skywalk i walked inside of a hotel and the building was straight locked down with multiple upgrades absolutely beautiful what does this arrival stock and these has to do with 2050 in the future well if arrival is around which i really do believe while seeing what's happening in the market that arrival is going to be around now if you think one second by 2050 that this stock isn't then i believe that a lot of people are wrong let me scroll down even further okay because i recently did see some good news i believe that i have skipped it they even partner with certain bike company that's electric Okay, it's not only about EVs, it's about the impact they are doing on a new society. Arrival Share plans to invite actual Uber drivers to participate. Okay, so these are competitors. They have the technology, they have the use, use for it. Man, look, 86 cents, all I'm saying is if I bought all the way up around when it was $17, can you imagine how I would feel at 86 cents a share with Arrival? 
man, I'm bullish. I'm bullish. That's I'm bullish. And if I can move, moon, then I'm going to the moon. That's all I'm saying. I know a lot of people took a lot of loss, a lot of loss because they believed it, but they believed in it when the market was red. I'm taking advantage. I hope that y'all all enjoying this content. I hope that y'all all make the right decisions in this market. Shout out to the people who are still staying strong in their bags. I understand that the market is really red and down. But to more motivation out there, it's better to think long term. Like, I believe that the long term investors or somebody who really felt that it was going to impact then and there when it was really high up, I feel like a lot of them, a lot of those wheels could be discouraged. But I'm saying out there, don't be discouraged. Be couraged. Because I'm out here telling y'all that I see the same exact vision. I'm just buying lower. I'm taking advantage and I'm continuing to take advantage. I'm in the same market with y'all out there and it's holding and holding and holding that believes in the future. I ain't listening to God. I hope that y'all all enjoyed this content. Please leave comments down below. I will leave my Robin Hood link down below. Let me know. That being said, I'm out. Peace.